thumbnails. Find out what's allowed and what's not so that you can keep your channel safe and monetized. Hello, hello! This is Freedom Quick Tips where we dispense industrial grade knowledge to help keep your channel squeaky clean and in tip top shape. Thumbnails are arguably the most important piece of metadata your videos can have. Thumbnails have the most impact on your click through rate or CTR. So it's no surprise that there are rules specific to them and on what's allowed. What are those rules you say? I thought you'd never ask. YouTube's constant thumbnail policy states that custom thumbnails that violate our community guidelines are not allowed on YouTube. So as long as your thumbnail doesn't violate YouTube's community guidelines, you're good. Short and to the point. Excellent. Well, that's it for this video. Thanks for watching. See you all next time. What? Examples? Oh, alright. We had to push you today, are we? Hm. Don't post a thumbnail on YouTube if it fits any of the following examples. Note that this is not a comprehensive list and is comprised of the more common examples. Thumbnails that include pornographic images. This would violate the nudity and sexual content policies and is something that YouTube has been consistent with through the years. If this has come to a surprise to you, then you may have a different tube platform in mind, of which I am unfamiliar with. Right. Moving on. Violent imagery intended to shock disgust. This would violate the violent or graphic content policies. Gory or violent content intended to elicit shock or disgust is not allowed on YouTube. You can report about violent incidents or talk about such in an educational way. But the violence or subsequent gore should not be the focus of the video. Thumbnails misleading viewers into thinking they're about to view something that's not in the video. This would be against spam, deceptive practices, and scam policies. We've gone into detail regarding this particular policy in a previous video. Link in the descriptions below. But in a nutshell, your video should deliver on the promise your metadata gives your audience. This is by far the most common thumbnail issue that we've seen creators have. If your thumbnail shows you in a pool full of spaghetti noodles, then there should at the very least be a scene of you in a pool full of spaghetti noodles. So does this mean that you can't get creative with your thumbnails? Definitely not. You should be creative with your thumbnails. Again, your thumbnails help your CTR more than your titles or video descriptions. But don't get creative to the point that you're doing the old bait and switch with your videos. So to recap, no nudity, violence, gore, or misleading images in your thumbnails. Make it eye-catching, but also truthful. Because all of those watch hours aren't going to help you if your channel gets demonetized or terminated. If you have any questions, let us know in the comment section below. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and ring that notification bell icon. See you all guys in the next Freedom Quick Tips. Goodbye.